Hello Aries and welcome or welcome back to my channel, mark my words, my name is Nicoleta and today I am back with your message for the next 7 days. So, let's see, let's jump right in, let's see what is your message. Aries, what are you going to do next week? So let's see, Aries. It is in these next seven days there is an emphasis on you seeing in detail some aspects oh wow of your subconscious mind but how is this going to play out there is the element of crystal quartz here and if I'm not mistaken it is last week I think you had um, the message of getting in touch more and more with the crystals. You were growing a connection with the crystals. It seems like the message from last week is bleeding, bleeding into your message for this week. This week's deal. This week that's going to start today or tomorrow. Okay. So, it feels like the connection between you and Crystal Quartz is strengthening. Crystal Quartz is all about seeing things clearly but, and also magnifying things in order for us to understand, to understand some details about a certain situation. And for you, my friend, it feels like over the next seven days your subconscious mind somehow, wow, Wow, bear with me guys, the information that's coming through is mind-blowing. Somehow your subconscious mind is blending with your conscious mind. How? I remember I watched, uh, it was a short on YouTube with Dr. Joe Dispenza. Maybe you are actually uh, working with Dr. Joe Dispenza in one way or another. Maybe you purchased his meditations or maybe you are encouraged to do that. But leaving that on the side, he said that if you can keep yourself awake in that moment where, before falling asleep, right, that when you are very relaxed, and it's right, that moment right before you fall asleep, I think that's, I'm not sure what state of the brain is that, gamma or... I'm not sure guys, you can Google it, you can find more information on Google for sure, on YouTube about Dr. Joe Dispenza's work. But it feels like something like that is going to happen to you. You are going to, your brain is going to be in that state. Maybe you meditate a lot, maybe you, you are very good at this technique, maybe, maybe, maybe. But what I'm seeing here is a similarity in techniques here in one way or another and because you are or somehow you are in that state you can reprogram your subconscious mind and I keep hearing pest control pest control now some bugs right some insects that you don't want there they are there, of course, in your subconscious mind, and they are coming to your conscious mind over the next seven days. Now, you are encouraged to not spend a long time, a lot of time, over this situation because it feels like you are in a process of self-discovery, Aries, and uh, things that probably were said to you in the past, maybe you had a friend, maybe maybe someone, because there, there is a feeling here that someone in the past told you some things, but you were maybe not ready to hear, you, you were maybe not ready to understand those things about yourself. It seems like now is the time for you to understand those things. Mother Nature, the power of the crystals, is there to help you. So, if you don't feel it yet, if you are not in the crystal world yet, just put the intention to connect with the crystals, especially this, this um, I, I'm, I'm getting that last week it was all about the uh, rose quartz for some here, maybe for all of you, 
and also I hear greenaventurine, tourmaline, tiger's eye. But now, this week, the all eyes are on the crystal quartz. Let's pull a card. Aries, very interesting. Long story short, so far, over the next seven days, you get to know yourself better. A blind spot. It's not going to be so blind anymore. You will see it. Okay, here it is. Beautiful. You are a fire sign. Okay, you are a fire sign, it is, and it feels like what they are showing me here is you have the tendency to blow that fire on other people. There is an imbalance here that you will notice how um, you will notice this imbalance that's very common met in empaths or empathic people where you want to keep giving, you give, you give, you give, Aries, but what you are going to understand and notice probably, or maybe this is one thing that you are going to understand and notice about yourself is when you give so much to your own detriment, right, is when you are trying to manipulate people in one way or another. You are, you are going to understand why you are doing this. There is a fear behind it all, right? And so if you think about this dynamic between empath and narcissist, the narcissist is taking, right? That's what they do. They are taking, um, they are taking, they are not giving anything, right? And the empath is giving, 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 giving a lot. And so if you, maybe one of you here, all over your life, you have been entertaining this kind of dynamics, maybe not with pure blood narcissists, right? But people with severe toxic behavior towards you. And so that's what's changing this week. That's what's changing. And because this is changing, um, Aries, because this is changing for you, you are going to find yourself in relationships in particular, all types of relationships, the next level is coming up. And what I'm saying the next level is you are now going to see clearly what you have been entertaining in the past. You are now going to see clearly that past version of yourself. You are now going to see clearly how that behavior was feeding a part of you that still needed to be fed in one way or another. Profound healing, it is profound, profound healing. And this is like, uh, this is snowballing for you. This is, you are in a healing process that you cannot stop or cannot be stopped. There is the element here of snowballing, becoming bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. It is like, you notice this thing and then you are curious about another thing and another thing and another thing. And this is going to take the majority of your time moving forward maybe over the next couple of months maybe until we reach your season and when we are going to reach your season Aries it feels like you will be mad the universe is going to gift you something there is a gift for you around your season maybe around your birthday birthday beautiful okay this card wanted to inspiration look at this inspiration. Right off the bat, this card Aries reminds me of something that I saw today. Uh, I saw a reading from someone and she said something like someone, this might be you or this might be someone else and you find that someone very inspiring. Someone is very unique, very unique and very uh, authentic right? And maybe Aries, maybe you are learning how to be authentic, maybe you are learning how to be rooted in your own authentic self still and for now there is this feeling here of 
you being a follower or this can be vice versa okay or this can be you can be the authentic one and someone here might be your follower um and this person they are an inspiration for you or you for them okay and so it is okay for you to let yourself be inspired and to be a follower for a while okay maybe i'm saying these things because you know how they what they say about uh aries you guys you are a natural born leader right you are a natural born leader you are passionate you are fiery and you don't like to follow it's in your blood to lead in one sense or another but there is a process in this specific case scenario probably where you have to take a step back and remember when i mentioned that you, you uh, did i mention this i don't remember now i'm channeling and it's i forget very fast um you're a fire sign and dragon like you you used to blow your fire on others maybe to help them to overgive yeah now you stop and you are starting to blow this purifying fire in a way okay so you are taking back your energy being inspired by someone or something here you are taking back your energy and you are purifying yourself in one way or another and you are okay now i'm getting you're okay now to be in the beginner beginner's mind state in a period of let me hold my horses let me let me recalibrate myself in a sense let let me relearn about myself by being some sort of a follower to an inspiration path here someone here is inspiring you here it is over the next seven days okay you are a leader but you understand you will understand over the next seven days that sometimes in life it's okay to take some steps back and to swallow our ego and to go ask those ones that inspire us what do you think about this what do you think about that um can you help me with this can you help me with that to be humble at some level and to accept that we don't know everything and to take some advices from those people that inspire us this is what i feel is happening for you there is the accent here there is an accent there is an emphasis here in your uh reading in your week here ahead aries the month of april there is a lot of magic and i'm seeing till swan I don't know why maybe till swan is your inspiration the month of april there is a lot of magic and a lot of golden light you see a lot of golden light beautiful beautiful energy for you waiting and i feel an increase in abundance money in particular for you aries in the month of april else here there is like guys it is so interesting because also in the month of april i don't know why spirit wants to talk today about the month of april probably to inspire you <laughs> yeah right to inspire you to another way of telling you don't give up aries you are is all worth it i wanted to say you are almost there but almost there where we don't know yet it's all worth it let's put it that way um and in the month of april also because i didn't finish my sentence there is a merging between you and um, i don't know why i'm seeing till swan guys maybe maybe one of you out there is uh, till swan like and the spirit of till swan somehow is merging with you um seems like till swan created an energetic path for those like you Maybe you will purchase some something from Till Swan. I don't know, but this is what I'm I'm getting. Um, 
spirit is saying, yes, she created energetically a path. It is like through her healing, she creating she created this path. So those, those like you can follow, you see there is this element of being a follower for a while until you can bloom into the leader that you really are. And I guess this is going to, going to be the title of your reading. You are blooming into the leader that you are meant to be, Aries. Thank you very much for being here. See you next week. And guys, if you are interested in my 21 purification program, please send me an email. I have my email address in the description box below. I will send you more information and I will post about it uh, in the days to come for sure. Thank you very much, Aries. See you next week.